The Speaker of the House of Representatives, Right Honorable Abbas Tajuddin, has pledged his commitment to appropriate legislation that will foster digital learning and technical education in the country. Abbas said this during a public hearing organized by the House Committee on Federal Polytechnics and Higher Technical Education on four bills that seek to establish the National Vocational Center, the Federal Artificial Intelligence Institute, Alia de Benue State, Federal College of Science and Technology, Askira Uba Borno State, the National Institute for Technical and Vocational Education, Wamba Nasarawa State. The speaker, who was represented by Honorable Owal Gwalabe, a member representing Katagum, Federal Constituency of Bauchi State, also assured that polytechnic education will continue to be relevant to the Nigerian economy for the much-needed industrial development. Earlier, the chairman of the committee, Honorable Faud Kayode Laguda, said each of the bills is designed to improve Nigeria's educational development and to promote sustainable human capital development necessary for a self-reliant society. He further stated that there is a need to prioritize and recognize the advantages that come with science, technology, engineering, and mathematics STEM in driving economic growth. These initiatives are not merely legislative proposals. They represent a commitment to our nation's future, a future where education serves as a cornerstone for economic growth, social mobility, and national development. Establishing these institutions will ensure that quality education in science skills, art, and technical will, and vocational training will become accessible to all Nigerians. As you may be aware, we cannot, at this period of our social economic development, underestimate the importance of science technology as the key drivers of our psychoeconomic development. There's a need, therefore, to prioritize and recognize the advantages that come with science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, STEM, in, in driving the economic growth. Furthermore, there's a need for adequate empowerment of Nigerian youth with knowledge of technologies to adequately optimize their contributions to Nigerian industrialization. The speaker said the idea is to establish higher technical institutions that will provide qualitative education in the science, skill acquisition, arts and technical and vocational education. The House of Representatives, as a responsive institution, has recognized the critical importance of education as a key driver in the reform and development of the social sector in Nigeria. This is because the quality of human capital, which is necessary for development, will largely depend on the quality of education. Education must not only be qualitative, but must also be accessible to all. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.